From WNY News, this is First Morning Weather. Well, welcome back. Live at the track here, ARCA race going on right now behind me. Band uh, PA line setting up. Lots of activities going on across uh, the area right now up here at the track. A lot of festivities for families to partake, and weather couldn't be nicer all across the region today, and it looks like it's going to stay that way through the weekend. Let's take a look at our sky cam. We're going downtown now in Watkins Glen to the lakefront, and a beautiful scene here. Lots of great visibility, blue sky here, and just a great night to be outside. Now, as we take a look at high temperatures uh, for the region today, uh, topping out in the upper 70s and lower 80s, I managed to hit the lower 80s at the Elmira Corning Regional Airport. Looks like we may do a couple degrees better both tomorrow and on Sunday. Now, currently across the twin tiers, again, most spots in the upper 70s and lower 80s, the humidity is low, so it is quite pleasant out there. It's not oppressive in terms of the humidity, but moving forward, the humidity does come up a little bit over the next couple of days. Let's check out that weekend forecast for you, and again, pretty much more of the same. High pressure remains in control. Lots of sunshine both Saturday and Sunday. Both days we're forecasting temperatures in the mid 80s with light winds. Satellite radar imagery showing some more active weather off to our south and especially southwest where the remnants of Francine continue to spin over the mid Mississippi River Valley, Tennessee Valley. All that though will be suppressed to our south in the coming days thanks to an area of high pressure. So as we zoom in closely, again, not much happening across our neck of the woods. And again, we are expecting dry weather to last at least until the first part of the upcoming week. Uh, our surface analysis showing that big blocking area of high pressure in control. And as long as that high pressure system is nearby, uh, our weather is going to stay on the quiet side. Now things eventually start to change as we head into uh, the middle of the upcoming week. But let's get into tomorrow's forecast. Again, we'll have some foggy conditions to start, but once the fog burns off, plenty of sunshine through the afternoon, temperatures topping out in the low and mid 80s. And if you happen to come up to the track here on Sunday for the big race, go bowling at the Glen. Our official race forecast Again, calling for mostly sunny skies at a temperature of 84 degrees. The UV index, though, will be moderate, just like it's been over the last several days. So if you're coming up to the track or spending time outdoors, definitely want to wear some sunscreen and have the sunglasses handy. All right, let's take a look at our five-degree guarantee for today. Uh, we forecast a high temperature of 84, 81, the unofficial high at the Elmira Corning Regional Airport. So as we take a look at our forecast for tonight, keep it mainly clear, some patchy valley fog possible, lows in the mid 50s. For tomorrow, plenty of sunshine, five degree guarantee of 84, and we keep the pleasant weather going at least into the first part of next week. Some changes though by Wednesday and Thursday can give you about a 30% chance for showers then. Temperatures dip just a little bit midweek, but stay above average right through the period.